Yeah, 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 yeah. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Come on in, come on in. Come get some of this good love and encourage. So my name is KB. My name is Tadashi. We are doing a 48-ish uh, tour, day tour uh, with Winter Jam, and um, we've been on it for about 15 dates now. So front lounge, you know, this dual TV side, of course, so people on each side can see the TVs. Uh, over here is the sound system where you can plug in. You got the auxiliary cord. But usually for us, at least for me, I'm more of a relaxer. So I, I try to find a good cushy seat, sit down, turn on ESPN, and then find the snacks. Damn! And then find the snacks. That's my thing. So, so when you take peanut butter, <laughs> and you mix it with honey bunches of oats, <laughs> you got good life. You got a good life. So over here, you know what I'm saying? Because we like to... There's more honey know, bunches of oats? <laughs> we like to keep it in excess, you know what I'm saying? When you're balling out of control like this, you got to have the different cracks and crevices filled with the goodies. So you got a little bit of Reese's going on here, little chips of oil. Now these ain't the regular chips of oil. No, 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 no. We do the chewy chips. We have only the finest. Now you you have to you have to see this. Ready? Lacroix. Lacroix. I don't know what you know about this, but now you LaCroix. gotta keep a pinky in there when you, you drink gotta, that. When the you pinky drink ain't LaCroix, up. It's carbonated water, but it's the best I know of. I love it. I love it. So you know you keep that on deck, water. But then you know it's a culture now. It's not just a thing. It's a culture now to care about your coffee. So you got the Keurig, so you, you got the, the whole pour over system here. You know, we had some this morning. You know, that's how it goes down, the magic bullet. Um, and then this this is the drummer, this is Mo. The DJ Sincere right here, up, and buddy? they're the Fruit Rule Up Kings. Scooby, <laughs> Scooby, Scooby Snacks. snacks. Scooby snacks. I don't know what's happening, man. I don't know. So as you can see, you know what I'm saying? This, this isn't just normal right here. This, this is next. Level. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little reluctant to show this because you know when I go home, when I go home, everyone says, How was the road, man? I know I know it must be hard out there. And I'd I'd hate to expose the fact that we have these amenities laid out before us that I don't normally get. Yeah, I don't want to go too far with it. Now, you know, some people, I need you to see it this way, but there are some other people who I need them to think, brother, it's hard out there for you. I, I feel sorry for you exactly. having to be gone from home all this time. And right. I just kind of go, you're right. And then yeah. I come back to this. <laughs> um, so yeah, we got, you know, just sort of the regular you gotta have your junk condiments and things of that nature. You gotta have we got some drawer. Oreos and fruit More. snap. I promise we don't eat this all the time. We juice. We, we do juice. juice That's and why we got the magic <laughs> bullet. That's why you got the magic job. bullet, because you juice. Um, the we other cool draw. thing is uh, underneath these seats right here are these large subs. Um, so I got to hear Tadashi's new project in HD um, because um, it's sort of like a surround sound um, treated room. I mean, the, the, everything sort of sounds full in here yeah. um, by God's grace. I'm glad that we were able to get this one because. Um, I feel comfortable with playing mixes for folks and listening back to things uh, and having it sound the way that we created. The only challenge is this button is more complicated than 90% of my life. I mean, this remote control is more complicated than 90% of yeah, my life. I think you got to have a degree, of, like a uh, college degree. Uh, or something like that. So what we do is we grab survive. this gentleman right here. Come here, Sammy. <laughs> Sammy Sosa here. And he is at, oh, it's simple to him. So what you trying to say? We're idiots? Simple. You know, racism. It's He's being simple. racist right now. Did you catch that? Race card on the table right there. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, so we, he helps us get everything hooked up because this can be rather challenging. But it's cool, man. You know, but it's, it's good to have those amenities. It's good to have the sound system because one of the things that can happen, this is an arena tour, and a lot of times with a lot of people on a tour like this, the, the dressing room situation can be a little shabby, a little small, right, right, and this, right. you know, it extends out. This whole area is not as big as it looks when we're riding. It's a little more cramped, but when we come out on the show, it opens up more, and this can kind of become our own escape, a little private time to get away. So it's more than just, I mean, it really is the place we live. So it's more than just amenities and snacks and right, fun, right, but right. there's a there's a space open for us to kind of come to to kind of get away for a minute and have our right, own time. Right. That's always good. Yeah, shout out for Winter Jam for making all this possible, because yes. that's... You know, it's difficult being away from home on any level. Yeah. Uh, 
if, you know, depend, no matter what the home situation looks like, being away from your family is always challenging. So it's nice when we can have a homely type vibe when we are on the road um, that transcends even if we just like hotels or, you know, obviously transcends sitting in airports all day. Yes. So uh, I'm grateful for the, you know, it's, you know, it feels like a, a nostalgia, a reminder of, you know, what we left as we get ready to go back, so. Yeah, great. Um, so, I think people like Frozen. I don't know, is that a thing? Is that they, a thing? So, yes. Stephanie's on this bus. She loves Frozen Reese's. Is that a thing? Do people eat Frozen candy? So we didn't we didn't do that in the hood. No, uh, I didn't do that. We in the froze hood. batteries. Froze batteries. Thank you. Yeah, yes, yes. <laughs> yes. I put my batteries in the freezer. So you can find our, our batteries are in there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Now. But, but you do have, you know, you do have the the fruit when we do juice or blend. Try to get that going. Um, a little, a little, a side berry. Is it a side? A side e? We ain't had it in the hood either. We had, <laughs> I had, I had Kool Aid. I had Kool Aid. <laughs> you come down here. Never do, look, don't do this one. Let this that is, one go. Let that one go. Polar bear is not as good as LaCroix. You don't want well, that. Look, baby, we but stocked you know. in there, oh, though, We man. stocked, bro. We stocked. And it's healthy, cuz. And it's healthy. <laughs> we don't mess with the, you know, got the soy milk, the almond milk. Got to have salsa. Got to have the OJ. Yeah, we stocked. Very nice. Low fat, though. Did you catch the low fat, though? We out here sitting down getting fat in the middle. We try to do things to mitigate the problem. That's so it, that's why you got your little fat situation. That's why you got it going. Just get a little more of a scene. You don't have time to juice, you know. You gotta do what you can. You gotta do what you can. But you do need to stay, you know, somewhat health conscious out here. Because you're, you're constantly going. I mean, we on stage, exerting energy, sweating, running around. You got other stuff you gotta do. Plus right, you try right. to work out during the day. So right, right, right. yeah, if you're not health conscious at some point, it can, it can get rough. Yeah. So now here is the uh piece Are y'all interested? Stones. Are y'all interested in the bathroom? I, I think they should be. Put them on T I think they should be. We try to keep it clean. There are ladies on the bus, so it wouldn't be the typical this will smell. There's not like a lot of Filth running around in there because uh, there are ladies on the bus. We do have an and it issue. has a singular usage. Yes, yeah, that's what I was about to say. And I don't want to go into more detail on that, but just thinking once, not Only two. Once. <laughs> singular. Only once. Pardon the language. If there are deuces on this bus, you will be kicked off of this bus. For everyone mind. will hate you right. to their core. So this is designed for singular. Singular purposes. You get not only do you get excommunicated, but you do have a fine. There's a you get fine. There's a three hundred fifty dollar fine. Oh shoot! Not, not and you the have tour, you have to from, clean it. You too. have to clean it. Not Yourself. from the tour. That's the bus company. So that's the policy. So we this room is you know for one purpose, one yes. purpose yes. only. So yes, 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 now yes. one thing I didn't know. I don't know if a lot of people didn't. I, one thing I didn't know. I got up and I got ready to brush my teeth. And I walked to the sink and my man stopped me and said, Hey, hey treat that water like you're in Mexico. And at first I was offended. I was like, what are you talking about? But he was like, it's not clean water for you to brush your teeth with. And then you have to get bottled water. So that's why we have a lot of bottled water too, because you have to open up the water, clean your brush, brush your teeth, rinse, gargle, all that, because bus water is not clean. Don't drink it. It may look like this when you turn it on. That might be bus water, I don't know. Other thing too, <laughs> other thing too is, um, so up here, obviously where the driver is. Yeah. And um, here's something the artists don't do. What I've tried to do is uh, uh, at least a couple times a month or so, come up here and sit with the driver. Mm. And uh, and it's it's this, it feels like it's designed for somebody you know to sort of spin here and have a companion to talk to or whatever. But the stories that these individuals have are through the roof. So our driver actually just got off the Madness tour with The weekend and Travis Scott. Yes. Um, before that, he was out with um, uh, Carrie Hills. What is, who else was he out with? He was out with Kid Cudi. Um, he was out with, um, I think he was out with Lupe Fiasco. He was out with a bunch of different folks. And the stories that they have to share are just good for the soul. And things that they have to do, because a lot of things that they go through that while we're sleeping, we don't realize, like, you know, seeing people 
um, on the side of the road and, and being responsible for all the lives in here. So I like to spend some time with the bus drivers as well just to uh, be sure about who's driving me, number one, because I'm asleep. And then number two also just to connect and hear all the dope stories and people who've actually been on the bus that we're renting. So it's pretty fun. Right here you have... Get your behind up! What is it's the DJ, he should be working. He taking naps, man. This is what we gotta deal with out here with these lazy workers. <laughs> <laughs> lazy workers. Yeah, these are the bucks. Are you a are you a up, down, or middle guy? Bro, I gotta be middle. I can't do up or down. You like middle. I like to be on the ground level. This is me down here. So I, all you do is you just wanna come down here, do a few dips, very short dips, and then just roll in. Feel what I'm saying? This is my little coffin. Mine's on the other hand. I'm right here in the middle. Now, when you're away, one of the rules on the bus is keep all your stuff in your bunk when you're not sleeping so it doesn't get you know too crowded or messy. I don't think everybody keep that rule, but whatever. <laughs> um, but that's the inside of mine. It's, you know, try to keep it super clean. That dope part is, you know, you got your air vents. Keep it cool or warm if you got the heat on. Up here are the plugs. But the dope thing that most people don't know about, like you got the little car jack as well for the charger up here is the dvd vcr do they even have vcrs and buses anymore dvd tv <laughs> that joint comes down now another thing i use my bunk for that probably is a little shameful but i don't care um i keep my soup there i don't like nobody eating my soup i love soup i can't do it i need my campbells see this is what can happen when people don't keep the rule when you're not hearing things go in your bunk, because then you just got randomness everywhere, man. So, you know, you have to have what they call bus meetings. Usually on most tours, you have a bus mom. That's just the title of the person. It could be a, a, a guy or a girl, but we happen to have girls on the bus. We have a bus mom who kind of keeps things in order. So we go to her, and then she sits everyone down, and they have what they call a come to Jesus talk. And basically, that's, <laughs> that's to get them right. That's to get them in line, man. So it's, it's another lounge area, a little smaller than up front, but you got a TV sound system here and this is what we do all our money count you know what i'm saying yep. so yep. it's not much for me this was this is this is me right here so they put down the table and fold and say here's your pay kb and this is what i contribute see you with joy can't forget all the money we count back here. <laughs> but then you got a closet here open space just for jackets some people put vacuums and whatnot in there so cleaning supplies and then you know you got your mirrors but they got the handles because they're apartments for you to store other gift stuff, basket. gift baskets, closet area there. So yeah, that's what that is. But what do you do back here? What's what's one of the things you do? Um, normally in the morning, I come back here first because it's warm. They have to keep the the bunk area. bunk area very very cold so folks don't get sick. So um, so after I sort of and I'm I got tropical blood. I'm from Tampa. So the moment I get out of my bunk, I start, you know, crystallizing with ice. So I just run straight back here. And this is where I sort of defrost and uh, sort of gather my thoughts. I pray back here. Um, sometimes reach out to my wife and just see how she's doing, how her morning's going. Yeah, I, I agree. I come back. I might spend some time praying or reading or whatever. Um, FaceTime. Is, this is the best room to do FaceTime. Yeah. You know, turn it as bright as you want. Up front. More people kind of gather, you know, but back here you can kind of have a little solitude. FaceTime with the family or, um, and then another thing I'm doing, because like you said, I'm working on an album. So I'll come back with my stuff. Um, I got all my equipment here to demo. So I just pull out all the stuff from Pro Tools and I just start demoing stuff. Now don't judge me, because I did say demo. It's a little, little uh, mic. mic. Where'd that mic come from? From, probably from somebody old from radio. From the 40s. Right here, bro. I do first a, mic they from made. The 40s. <laughs> I do a radio show too, um, engine radio. This is a hip hop show called Serium. So I'll record the show on the road, try to get interviews with people like this brother. Just, you know, he stood me up the other night, but it's good. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just playing. But at the end of the day, man, like I said, come back, get a little reading done, um, get on the laptop, and get some work done. So listen, man, thank you so much for hanging out with us. My name is Tadashi. You can find out anything you want to find out about me at Tadashi.com. You can also check out ReachRecords.com. We're all on social media, so just find the name Tadashi. You'll know what it is, man. And, you know, we're on tour right now, so you need to check that out, too. Yes, indeed. So it's K, the second letter, 
KB if you missed that. Find all my stuff on whoiskb.com and stay in touch with what's going on with my happenings. So we're going to get it popping here. Your time is up. You got to go. Peace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peace. Yeah. You want me to do this a little? Just give you, you're getting out of here. Hold on. Bye.